story and this is breaking from Mumbai or Maharashtra where exactly seven months after he was shot dead outside his Kolapur house, the Maharashtra police have finally arrested the alleged killer of rationalist leader Govind Rao Pansari or so they are claiming. A man called Samir Gaikwad, an alleged activist of right-wing Sanatan Sansta, was taken into custody. He was remanded to seven-day police custody after his arrest. The police have been tracking the movement of Samir Gaikwad after a tip-off. The Sanatan Sansta now saying it will offer legal help to Gaikwad, who used to work for the outfit. Remember, Govind Rao Pansare was shot dead in Kolapur city on February 16th and then succumbed to injuries four days later. Let's go straight across to uh, our guest, Naveen Chomal is the advocate for the Sanatan Sanstra. Mr. Chomal, what is the case that you have to defend at the moment? Are you saying the police has arrested the wrong person? Our person is right. The police are wrong. I, are you let exact? Is it not true that the Sanatan Sansta has been taking on the likes of Mr. Pansare and rationalists? The police are claiming they have evidence that Mr. Gaikwad was in some way in the group that was targeting Mr. Pansare. Let me dispel the erroneous notion. Hmm. Neither our activist Samir Gaikwad nor the Sansta, Sanatan Sansta has got anything to do with the murder of Govindra Pansare. Please appreciate, hmm. Pansare had nothing to do against Sanatan Sasta or any other Hindu organization. Hmm. The crux of the matter is that shortly prior to the murder of Pansare, hmm. Sanatan Sasta and various other Hindu organizations were actively taking part in a moment exposing the misdeeds of a land mafia builders who had grabbed 800 acres of land of Hindu temples in Kolapur city, mm. in and around Kolapur city. Mm. And we have succeeded to the extent that the police had found the case to be genuine and the process of taking back the land has started. Mm. So it is the movement of or a brain child of some of the underworld mafia who had killed Pansare and somehow sent the cat Why, loose. why has the police all. then arrested Mr. Pa why has the police arrested your client then? Why has the police arrested your client? Even, Let's be clear. Even, even, the Sanatan Sansta in the uh, past yes, sir, has yes, been sir. accused both in the Thane blast as well as other incidents yes. of targeting oh. people who are opposed to their right wing ideology. You cannot deny that Mr. Uh, Chomal on this program. Uh, the cases, for example, Gadkari Rangayatan had nothing to kill with some, per, some person. Our ideology is not to kill any other person. And Parsare was never in our target list. Why has the police had arrested had your client? In the Why has the police exactly. then arrested Let your us, client, yes, sir? Exactly, yes, yes. I would like to assist your viewers by saying that police themselves are not claiming to be having the conclusive proof. They have arrested him on the basis of suspicion. And suspicion they have derived only because of some call records, that's all. So, it is... Did your client threaten test. Mr. Pansari no. at any stage? Did your client threaten Mr. Pansari? No, never. Never? Your client no, did never, not threaten never, Mr. Never, Pansari? Never. You are denying no, that? No, never, never, Is never. the San Sanatan exactly. Sansta denying, involved in activities which involve targeting rationalist leaders, yes or no? No, no, no. In fact, nobody can teach us rationalism. Hindutva itself has embedded rationalism in itself. It is a phrase coined by several people who are having a leftist mindset, something anti-Hindu agenda, anti-national agenda or anti-Bharatiya culture agenda who call themselves a rationalist. For example, those who are caught taking hmm. Mejwanis from Pakistan and acting against Indian nation are calling themselves a rationalist. No, no, hold so on, hold on. The Sanatan, San San the Sanatan exactly. Sansta, sir, has, has yeah. been questioned in the past, as I said, for even terror attacks. So let the Sanatan Sansta also no, 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 first no, no, no. come out in the open and tell us exactly what they are up to. The Sanatan Sansta, sir, exactly. today let's, is, let's, let's, is accused of terror attacks. I gave you the example of the Thane Blast. Exactly. So Thane Blast was, uh, please appreciate, was not a terror attack. Yes. It was only some of the persons who had uh, were disgruntled had just to show their anger committed a blast which had nothing to do with taking lives of any other person. My God, I, you know, so I I wish every disgruntled person resorted to blast, sir. Disgruntled people don't resort to blast. No, no, but no, I'm no, going to ask you one justifying. last time. We are not just one last exactly. time on we are this not program. That. We are not justifying sir, that, sir. On this program, the I'm not I'm not going to say you are guilty at all. I want you to tell me you exactly. believe that your client has nothing to do with Pansare. Am I clear? One last time. 
Nothing exactly, to do with it. Exactly. Nothing to do. Nothing to do. Nothing okay. to do with Pansare's murder. We will. And Sanatan Sasta itself had nothing to do against Pansare. Pansare okay. was a respectable person of a different ideology, of course. But he had not worked against Hindutva or any organization. Okay. And we had nothing against him in person. Okay. So if we someone works against, against Hindutva, the then you have something against the person. We will leave it to the viewers to decide your definition of Hindutva, whether that allows disgruntled people, particularly to use blast to settle their scores. Whether it's a jihadi mentality or whether it's the Sanatan Sanstha, both have much to answer for. Let's we'll come, we will not leave this issue, sir. So we will come back in the in the days ahead as the case progresses.